quarantine in these hotels as a result of the operation of a humanitarian transport corridor set up and run by the Malian government. We have also embarked upon a wide-ranging response program with support from the WHO and the international community, which has helped us to the tune of 52 million euros. In fighting this disease, we are working in close cooperation with CDC Africa too, in order to improve research, contact tracing, and identification of those who are positive for COVID-19. We have an awareness campaign called One Malian, One Mask, which is organized in Terelia, free of charge distribution of masks to the people. We welcome the solidarity and resilience shown by our population on a day-to-day -day basis as we fight the coronavirus pandemic and we commit ourselves to continue to support them and increase that support. Our president has recently announced a credit line of 750 million euros to help us tackle the social and economic impact of the pandemic. Chairman, ladies and gentlemen, Mali, like all other African countries, needs testing equipment and PPE, respirators and ventilators. The fight against COVID-19 will demand the collective efforts of the entire world, and we will contribute to that. However, what COVID should not make us forget at the same time is that we need to fight other things as well, such as HIV, AIDS, diabetes, malaria, tuberculosis, and we need to keep up with our immunization campaigns. In conclusion, may I appeal to all the member states of the World Health Organization to mobilize so that Gavi can have its resources fully reconstituted at the forthcoming session on June the 4th. Thank you for your kind attention.